One of our advanced services is when you crown teeth. And there's a number of choices that we have as a dentist. You can use the old traditional crowns, the gold crowns or the silver color crowns, or you can use a crown fused to metal. They're the ones with the gray lines. Usually when people smile when they come to my office, the first thing they say is, oh, I hate that gray line at the gum line. I hate the, the, the black line. When people don't like their smiles, it usually relates to the old crowns that they've had. People want things to look natural and they want them to look beautiful and they want them to look white. Now, in today's times with dentistry, with all the advances in technology again, uh, we can offer the patients a lot of choices for natural colored crowns. And there's, a, there's porcelain crowns. There's a n number of different porcelain crowns that we can offer them. And we personalize all those porcelain crowns for the patients and their needs. But the patients need to know there are differences in crowns and there's different crowns that we can offer you. And when it comes to crown or single tooth replacements, an implant is still maybe the best single tooth replacement, um, but people can still consider replacing a single tooth with a bridge. And what a bridge is, is it's like a bridge you drive across. There's a land on either side and there's the bridge you drive on. So what a bridge is in the mouth is you put a crown on one side of the space, you put a crown on the other side of the space, and then you add the false tooth. That's what we call a three tooth bridge. So if, you, if those two teeth on either side need some sort of crown or strengthening anyway, then basically from a cost standpoint, a bridge is still a very acceptable procedure. It's a very good procedure. And a, an implant is a very good procedure too if you want to do an implant single crown. So there's, there's still places for bridges. One of the experts have said through over time, your best implant is no implant. So the idea is if you can save your tooth, save your tooth. And if you can't do it, then an implant's the, the, uh, the sing, one of the best single tooth replacements, but also consider a bridge. Well, the original visit to Dr. Herring was because I had a crown in the front from my former dentist that had fallen out, and he said he, could, he couldn't do anything more for me. And so I thought, I've got to go to someone I think is the best not knowing I was going to find the best. But anyway, um, when I got down here, he said, that root base is gone. So he said, you're going to have to have surgical procedure done there. So the wonderful thing was, I had that surgical procedure, and they cleaned it out. I came over here, and he put in a temporary crown. Nobody would have even known you know, that I'd had anything done because it matched so well. I think I even sang for a funeral and people didn't realize that, you know, I could spit this thing out if it, it wasn't in properly. So then we ended up doing a little bit more than that because, you know, you just can't put that one crown. It wasn't going to hold. I had to do the three. Well, if you do three from the front to the right, you better do three to the left so that they look good. And I think they look good. This place is just, it's not like going to a dentist. It's like going to visit family. They all become so close, and they're all so friendly and nice, and the techniques that he used were so easy. You know, I didn't ever feel pain. He didn't ever feel uncomfortable. His office is just 